going on, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? Becca, again, another reaction video. Today, we're going to get into Poppy Spit. This came out four weeks ago. I think she has a new album out. Um, it doesn't say. It just says new single out right now. But I think y'all mentioned she had a new album out or maybe an EP or something. New project. Uh, I have done some Poppy before. Poppy is a very different artist. You love to see it. I don't necessarily vibe with all of her music, but I do enjoy her uniqueness and how creative she is and how different she is. It's refreshing to always see someone different, even if you don't necessarily vibe with it. But we're going to jump right into it. Hope you're having a good day. Come vibe with your boy. Cool lipstick. Yo, this part goes hard though. What? <laughs> what? Why am I vibing? Rude. Let me spit in my face like that. Um. Yo, I don't know why that last like 30 seconds, whatever that was, I actually really liked that. <laughs> That's the part I like. The rest of it, nah, I didn't really care for. It's just too like weird and heavy and distorted and uh, I don't know. There's parts in the beginning where it sounds like she's doing slam poetry, but over this techno pop heavy metal hybrid fusion she's got going on, didn't really vibe with it. But the end, actually, that went really hard. Like I want to listen to that part over and over for some reason. That was addicting. Spit. I don't know. Maybe it'll grow on me, but that last part was a vibe for sure. So, this is what I like about Poppy, though. How different is that? Like, where else are you going to find something like this? I haven't heard it anywhere else. Um, this is very unique for, to her, I think, because I haven't heard it anywhere else, but it's so different. And one of my favorite things about it is the way Poppy looks. She has this sweet, innocent girl vibe that is kind of more like towards a pop star look in a way that you're like, why is this little like chihuahua so aggressive and so uh, like heavy, you know, it just visually doesn't make sense, which I think is hilarious. But the um, things that I do like in here, obviously the guitar and the drums are very good. And at parts where like no vocals, and I say this a lot about like heavy metal in general, um, some of that stuff that's too heavy for me, you take the vocals out and it's not as heavy and it's just the instrumentation is still dirty and like thick guitar and like crazy drums, but you take those vocals out, those gutturals and stuff, it's not as heavy. And so here, if you could take the vocals out for like two minutes of the song and then put the vocals back in towards the end, I'd play it again. I would vibe to that song over and over. The drums and the guitar were phenomenal. But the, uh, the chorus I did like, the spit, it reminded me of kind of like early corn, 
and Slipknot, especially there's one song uh, where they kind of do this, this cadence, this pause and then say the lyric and pause and say the lyric. Um, oh man, I forget the song, but it had kind of that vibe. So the chorus I did like, it was just a, the verses. I don't know something about the combination of the techno pop pace with the heavy and the distorted vocals and almost like slam poetry style, the way she was talking. I don't know. It was just a different vibe. Uh, not my, not my cup of tea, not my thing. Um, but the rest of it was all right. You know, the chorus was cool. And then the ending I actually really liked. So I don't know, man, I never know how I feel about Poppy. Every time I listen to Poppy, it's just an experience. Every time I just, it just resets, resets my brain in a way. I just don't know what to think. You know, every time I listen to her songs, which is why it's fun listening to her music. You know what I mean? Um, but this was a trip, dude. <laughs> I, I'd like to listen to more. You know, it, it's a cool experience. Even though I'm not really a fan of her music, I like hearing her music and seeing what she does next because it's kind of like you never know what you're going to get. And she's always trying to experiment and push the boundary and like not be in a box, which I really respect out of an artist and appreciate out of her doing that. So I wouldn't mind jumping in more, but this is, yeah, I'm not going to be playing this again, except for maybe that last part. That last part goes hard, but that'll do it for today's reaction video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment down below. It helps the channel grow. It helps the YouTube algorithm. If you're new here and you haven't done so already, be sure to hit that subscribe button and drop a video every single day. If you're not new here, welcome back. I appreciate the love and support as always. Thank you very much for showing up and showing love. You know what to do. Leave some comments down below. What did you think about this? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Are you a fan of Poppy? Are you a longtime fan? Are you new to Poppy? Are you in the same boat as me? Like, what's going on? But that last part goes hard. Can we all agree on that? I don't know. Let me know. As well as if you're a fan of Poppy, be sure to support Poppy. Always support the artists you like. Subscribe to her YouTube. Follow her on social media. Stream her music anywhere and everywhere you can because support is number one for any artist, band, rapper, creator, entertainer. Whoever's making content or music for you to enjoy and you do enjoy it, reciprocate that energy via support. So... With all that being said, I hope you're having a great day. I'm sending positive vibes your way, and until next time, I'm out. I'm